Welcome to the Footsteps to Brilliance dashboards where you can gather helpful insights and monitor your students' use of Footsteps to Brilliance and Clever Kids University. We recently updated the class dashboards to include even more valuable insights for teachers. Let's take a quick tour. Your main navigation is in this top bar. You can exit dashboards anytime by clicking this drop-down menu. You will start here by clicking the Menu button. In the menu, click your class name and then click Class Dashboard. Here are your class achievements for the school year. You might use these numbers to celebrate with students as the year progresses. Notice that you can change the date range here. Scroll down for a leaderboard by total hours, word count, books read, games played, or even books written. Use quick links to get to the most frequently used reports or see all reports by exploring these tabs across the top. If your students are using Clever Kids University, click here. This class has 20 students actively using Clever Kids U pre-reader. Click Show Students to see current progress. In the new attendance report, you will find student usage organized by day. This report defaults to the last seven days, but you can change the date range here. Notice that you can print or export if you need to demonstrate attendance for virtual learning. To monitor exactly what students are doing each day, go to the Activity Log All Activities. Initially, you will see all of your students with a count of the number of activities they touched during the date range. You can click on a student name to see details. Click on the writing thumbnail to see the student's work. Or filter by scores to focus on where students need help. To see students' writing portfolios, click the activity log, Writing by the program here. Click a student name to see that student's portfolio. Then click the thumbnail. To understand student proficiency across your class, click the Proficiency tab. This will show the distribution of your students across literacy domains based on ongoing formative assessment as they use the programs. Click to highlight one of your students across the graph. Trey is struggling on phonological awareness. He is doing okay in phonics. He is struggling in language. He has insufficient scores to report proficiency in reading comprehension. And he is doing okay in logic and reasoning. Now, let's click Flexible Groups to see recommended groupings based on proficiency. Click the domain and subdomain to see skills. Click Show Students to see recommended groups based on proficiency. Here are students who need support identifying the initial sound in a word. Finally, you can track learning growth from the beginning of the school year here. Now, let's take a detailed look at a student. Click the Menu button and then click the student's name. The overview displays the student's achievements for the school year. Activity in the last 30 days. Proficiency levels. Notice how I can drill in for details. and Current Progress in Clever Kids University. There's even a description of the student's current lesson with links to additional resources. In each of the other tabs, you can explore the student's detailed usage, see a gradebook of how the student is doing in each program they're using, 
monitor student activity in the activity log, the reading log, or the writing log, and monitor the student's growth. As you can see, there is a wealth of insight you can gain from the dashboard reports. The more your students use the Footsteps to Brilliance programs, the more insight you can gain.